Hello and welcome to a very inconsiderate episode of Phoenix Point. Here we are back at the Geoscape and we are waiting on the manufacturing of our scarab before we depart on a mission to Fort Edison to get some research and share it with a bunch of cyborgs. Uh, that's going to be odd, but we'll figure it out when we get to it. We're going to have to wait about 19 hours before the scarab is completed, and then we'll have to manufacture some ammo for it, unless I'm missing something. So let's continue forward. Okay, we've got a massive problem in what used to be England. New Jericho's haven there is under attack, so we should probably come to their aid. And that'll help us to smooth over some diplomacy problems when we raid the settlement down here. Let's load as many people as we can onto the Manticore. And off we go. Okay, it says in the readout here that the defending strength is better than the attackers, so we should be able to see some allies roaming around the map, and we need to probably stay out of the way just to make sure that we don't accidentally shoot each other. Everybody is here, and everybody needs to be here. Okay, here we are, and let's see what we can find in the immediate area. Are there any enemies or allies around? No, but there are three entry points for the enemy. Anyway, let's get set up. We'll send Tex over here, and we'll put him behind this car. Okay, we found an Arthron shield bearer. Maybe we should take the shot? Sure thing. Let's see. We'll free aim, and try to hit the pincer. <laughs> Oh, well, that did a little bit of damage. We should try to find a way to get to higher ground, but I don't know if that will work very well. We'll move Sophia over I'm this way you. to the ladder. She can't take a shot, but we can leave her here for the moment. Irina should get set up right here. Can she take the shot? Yeah, it's not ideal, but we can do something. Darn. What about Newt? Who did he spot? Oh, there actually is an ally over here. For now, let's put Newt over here. Where are the two enemies? I know there's one here, but there should be another one around here somewhere. Oh, it's over here. Yeah, we're going to have to get over there and try to get that heavy on our side so we can take that thing out. Luckily, Omar's jump jet ability should be able to do some work in that regard. We'll put him over here just so he's within reach of the heavy. Oh, and there's another new Jericho member here. In the meantime, we can move Takeshi over this way. Oh, there's actually two enemies here. Yeah, we'll leave Takeshi here for the moment and see what we can do later. Let's put Sophia on Overwatch in this direction. That's about it. I'll see the suckers. He's getting up close and personal. That could end disastrously. Yeah, that's not going to end well. What did he do that for? Take the shot, Sophia. Okay, that could have gone better, but she did some damage. Ah! Wait, did somebody shoot at that assault? Oh, uh... 
Okay. If I shoot from this far away, some of the bullets might hit that heavy, and I do not want that at all. So we're going to have to find a way to make do without that problem. Let's move to Keshi over here and see if we can take a shot from above. There are no good options here, but at least we can try to hit the shield or maybe the pincer. Uh... That's not ideal. Luckily, we can have Tex do some work. We'll have him aim for the torso. Yeah, that'll do just fine. Once more, let's take this thing down. Nice shooting, Tex. <laughs> okay, what can we do with Sophia? All of our enemies appear to be concentrated over this way, so maybe we could put her up here? Or maybe we should put the snipers up there. We'll move Knut over here. And we'll try to move Omar forward so we can take a shot at the enemies over there. Confirming target. There's an Arthron over here and we could probably hit it. What about Irina? Let's bring her over this way. Lining up a shot. Takeshi, uh, he can take a shot. We'll have him go after that same Arthron. Oh, that did a little better. We'll move Sophia up here and see Rolling what up. she can see around the area. All of our enemies seem to be over here, but maybe we should keep Sophia up there just in case something comes from over this way. And that's all we can do for now. Let's end the turn. Okay, there's something over here. I don't know what it is, though. Protecting humanity. I'll kick your ass. Nice! <laughs> that must be another new Jericho soldier. That was pretty bad. Ah! There's a Pandoran gunslinger here. Let's start with Omar and see what he can do. It would actually be ideal if the bullets went through the Arthron and hit the gas tank. Oh, that did the trick. It didn't fully get rid of the Triton, but it got rid of the Arthron. We'll take the W's when we can. What about Takeshi? We can probably take out the Triton from here. Or not. We'll try again. Not bad. Not bad at all. <laughs> it's kind of nice that ranged attacks work rather well on large maps like this. We can move Irina up here. Watch out, I'm moving in. It'll help us to take shots at anyone in this building. And if we can't do that, we can draw them out. We'll move Knut forward. Already there. 
And we'll move Tex over this way to link up with Sophia. Let's go. Oh, okay, there's another Triton in there. We can't take a shot at it, though, so we'll just get Let's into position. This. Yeah, we need to do some reloading. And we'll take on these aliens when we can get to them. Oh, more poison. Ah! Yeah, that assault's going down. Ah! Okay, that Arthron is in the open now, and we can probably take shots at it from above. Let's try that with Sophia. Can we do it with free aim? Sure we can. Wait, did that thing's arm fall off? Neat. <laughs> the thing's pincer fell off. <laughs> That's cool. We got one. Beautiful. What can we do with Tex? There's an enemy in there. Let's try it, just for the heck of it. Oh, we did something. Do it again. I think that one missed. Omar, we can move him over here. Be right there. And we'll put Overwatch in this direction. We'll do that with Irina as well. Nothing's getting past me. And we'll move Newt over here and put him on Overwatch as well. Got you covered. Takeshi too. That should be good enough because I don't think all four of them can miss, can they? I hope not. Nice shot, Omar. Nice. <laughs> cool. <laughs> Let's head back to the Geoscape. We got a machine gun and some ammo. That's pretty neat. Okay, there's a Pandoran colony, and it's now visible on the Geoscape. Oh, it's over here. Yeah, the mist is expanding, so once we take down Undefendable, we could probably attack the nest. Let's head back home and restock. We're gonna need to do some manufacturing. What are we short on in terms of magazines? Uh, the Firebird? And we'll do an AR-1. That's about it for now. We're gonna have to work on getting a Manticore just so we can get a second team up in the air, but that will come a little bit later. And we've got three hours until the Scarab is deployable. Let's head back home. We'll offload all of our troops and let them rest up a little bit. And we'll also level them up. Tex can be cautious and he can also dash. Oh, and he can also be a healer. We'll assign dash to him and level up his stats as well. Omar. Warcry seems very useful, so we'll go with that. And we'll increase Omar's willpower and strength. Irina, we could give her assault rifle proficiency and have her carry two long-range weapons. Or we could reduce her overwatch cost. Why not both? Yeah, that should give her a lot of flexibility. Let's give her an AR-1 and take away the pistol ammo. And we'll give her some AR-1 ammo. Takeshi? 
He can return fire. We'll go with that. And we'll increase his willpower. We'll let our troops rest up a bit. We want to deploy the Scarab at Phoenix Point. We've got plenty of missions with no time limit on them, so we'll just leave those go for a moment. Okay, we need to find a way to build more research labs, but do we have the resources for it? Yeah, we need more fab plants too. Okay, we have enough resources. All right, we can build another research lab that'll take four days to construct. What should we name this Scarab? I figured that Marshall is a good name. What about recruitment? Yeah, let's start to build up our second team. He's farsighted, he's a bombardier, and he's good in close quarters. That seems like the best option, from a certain point of view, of course. We'll wait another 14 hours and try to manufacture the Goliath grenade launcher. We need all the heavy firepower we can get if we're going to go after this new Jericho base. 14 hours to go. We'll take the med kit out and put that in his ready slot with some ammo. That should give him plenty of heavy firepower. What about Lewis? We can't take him on the mission, but we can outfit him, at least for the short term. He's proficient with the firebird, so we'll give him that and some ammunition. We'll put the ammo down here and give him a pistol with some backup ammo. Let's see what's over here. All right, I think it might be time to actually assault this base. We'll send Tex, Omar, Irina, Sophia, and everyone else, of course. I probably should have known that Marshall would take up three slots, but this provides a lot more options once we assault the base, so we'll send everyone. Let's prep for takeoff and move over there. Okay, we have to get the research data, but we don't need to eliminate the security personnel. Let's deploy the squad. We need to steal three pieces of research. Oh, and there's a sniper up here. So where is the research? Okay, one, two, three, and there's an option for a fourth one here. We have plenty of ways to get through this, but we need to first take care of this sniper. Well, of course we need to get into cover first, so we'll move Irina over here. The enemy's not in sight, but we could have her take a shot later. For now, we need some heavy firepower. Newt? No. Takeshi? Definitely. We'll switch out a magazine for a grenade. Send him Already over there. here. Can he throw it? No. This can Omar take a grenade first. shot? Yes, he can. All right, let's see what we can do to put him behind cover at least. Oh, we can't, but we can move him forward. Let's make this happen. Yeah, we'll have him lob a grenade over this way. <laughs> Nice! Okay, that got rid of the immediate threat, so we should be able to push forward and claim one piece of research here. Shouldn't be too difficult, I hope. We'll move Tex behind this car. Let's do this. We'll put Sophia there too. We'll put Newt over here. Actually, it might be beneficial to move him over here just so there's a bit of separation. And we'll put everyone we can on Overwatch, just to keep eyes on the doors. Tex, we'll look over here as well. We can put Sophia on this door. And that's it! Uh-oh. Yeah. Okay, we took out that sniper's gun, so that's useful. How did he miss? Uh! 
Newt took a bad hit. Uh oh. Oh no. You asked for it. <laughs> okay, what can Takeshi do? Can he lob a grenade? Where will it make the most difference? Yeah, this is the area with the most cover, so we'll have him lob it over here. Ow! And he can't take a good shot, so we'll have to rely on the rest of the squad. Irina? Can she do anything? Yep. We'll do some overwatch with our last action point. Can Takeshi do anything more? We'll have Tex move over here and take that sniper out. On the move. Nice shot. <laughs> uh, we need to try to get Omar behind some cover, because otherwise he's just going to be a bullet sponge, and we don't want that. And that'll have to do for now. Show them what we can uh. do. Oh, no. Fire it! Oh, Irina took a bad hit. Not again. We lost Irina. Oh no. Luckily, Tex should be able to get Let's some go. revenge. Ah! Omar needs to get some revenge. I don't like the fact, though, that we're sitting ducks for this assault person up here, so we're going to have to do something to solve that problem. We'll have Newt take a shot at the heavy. And miss pretty badly. Well, that's pretty awful. Holding position. I got this covered. You could beat the good guys. Orphan and fire. Oh, come on! Really? I'm hurt pretty bad here. I just felt something break. Okay, we're gonna have a bit of a problem here. We might have to abort the mission. Oh, at least we kept Sophia from bleeding out. Does anyone else have a med kit? Okay, that's not good. Hostile damaged. Seriously, no one else has a med kit? We'll have to do whatever we can. That helped a bit. Ah! Ah! Reloading. I don't think that Takeshi and Tex are gonna make it. Holding position. On the move. Takeshi's in better shape, so he might be able to make it to the extraction unless we miss something in Irina's backpack. 
Okay, nothing in particular, but there's a bunch of ammo here. Yeah, we're gonna have to end the turn and hope that that damned heavy doesn't launch another rocket at us. I guess we have no other choice. Okay, he's still bleeding. We need to get him out of here if we can. Unless there's a med kit over here somewhere that we're missing. Well, first, we'll have Omar launch a grenade at our enemy here. Eyes peeled. Maybe we can save everyone by eliminating this heavy. their med kit lying around we need to start looking no uh, what about over here are there any here sure damn tex is a goner i'm not sure about this we'll do what we can to evac takeshi and move forward with the mission otherwise Yeah, Tex is going to bleed out. Move forward with Newt and get that research. It's different in the field. We'll put Omar on Overwatch over this way. And we'll leave Takeshi here for the moment just in case. We'll reload Sophia's weapon and put her on Overwatch. Nothing's getting past me. Oh. <laughs> Ah, uh, crap. That's one. Running. We're gonna have to cast a vac to Keshi. We'll move forward, grab these two bits of research, and get the hell out. Sophie's gonna have to move over this way. We'll move Newt over here. And actually, we can have him move over here and then leave it go. Yeah, actually, we should do that because it won't be a risk to the rest of the team. I really, really wish that we didn't get two KIAs out of that. I'm sorry, Tex! It is right to be taught even by an enemy, even if they are cowards and traitors. The research we obtained is more than a set of upgrades. It is the first step in reclaiming the planet. Humanity will be born again, and this time, the cure will show the path. Okay, new research is available. I hope it's worth it, though. Oh, bionic technology. Cybernetic implants and prosthetics. That should be useful. Okay, we're gonna have to put that on the docket ahead of the Miss Sentinel and the Triton Autopsy. We'll do some reverse engineering as well, and we'll send our people home. That living quarters will allow us to recruit 16 operatives. We'll offload everyone. Let them heal up. And we'll transfer Lewis over to Phoenix Point. And that'll do it for this episode of Phoenix Point. I hope you enjoyed it. You stay frosty, and I'll see you next time.